one of the things I like about this program is that, like, once, you know, a person go in and they get the lab work, you all give us the information behind this. You actually have a, quote, unquote, genetic counselor that explains all of this. Yeah. Yeah, I think we came to realize as a field, and I, I wouldn't say it was me specifically, but, you know, the people working in genetics, I would say back in the, about the 1960s or so, began to realize that um, there's a lot of complexity in trying to help people understand um, genetic risks based on either family history or genetic testing. And as genetic testing has become more and more powerful, the need to explain to individuals and even to health providers um, how this works and what it means to them is, is a time consuming, um, complicated process. And that generated the discipline of genetic counseling, which um, involves training of individuals in the principles of genetics, but also in the principles of counseling um, in helping people understand complex information that, that may have relevance to their health. And it has um, resulted in a, a group of people who um, work professionally now to um, serve as kind of interpreters of genetic and genomic information um, to individuals so that it can help inform their medical decision making. Okay. Do you know what's happening in Birmingham? Download the What's Happening Birmingham app today on Android, iPhone, and iPad for free. Get info on everything you need to know about local news, events, businesses, restaurants, and more. Visit our website, what's happeningbham.com, or follow us on social media at Happening Beham for more information. Download the What's Happening Birmingham app today, your source for everything Birmingham.